Owie. This is a tale of eBay So I was kind of been looking on eBay for Burger King toys. Uh, as you may know, I am collecting Burger King toys currently. And I saw an auction that was labelled up McDonald's and Burger King toys. It was 99 pence starting bid and had about a week left to go. So I just put in the watch list thing and that's, somebody else is going to say that and it's not going to sell for 99 pence. So anyway, in the end, I put a bid on it for 99 pence and lo and behold, I won it. So that's always very good, isn't it? Uh, I think it was somewhat like £2.80 postage or £2.50. It came to about £3.50 all in. So here is my McDonald's stroke Burger King uh, action figure haul. So I haven't really given them a claim yet. So they are a little bit scruffy. So Marge there could do with a scrub. Now these are like the 1990 were there or 91 original Simpsons figures. So we have Marge Simpson. We also have Lisa Simpson who has no underpants on, which is a little bit concerning. The there you go. Unfortunately, with these ones, there is no accessories, but they do still have their necklaces on. This Nelson. Now, I've got some pretty interesting memories of this figure. Uh, I did trade something, which I don't know whether I've deliberately forgot because it was something I probably shouldn't have traded for it. And I say a trade, it was like a swap back in around about 1990. I got this guy and Mondo Gecko or some other piece of paraphernalia, possibly a sticker or something. <laughs> that was the type of stuff you'd swap in the playgrounds back in the day. So you got him, and also got Bart. Bart Simpson. And Maggie. So I think there's only uh, Bart Man and Homer Simpson. Obviously the accessories as well. Bart's skateboard's there though, so that's always pretty cool. So there's those. And there was also this mask guy, whose name has completely gone out of my head. I'm thinking Lester Sledge. I do believe that's correct. Good old Lester, see if I can stand him up. His legs are a little bit loose, but there we are. He'll teeter-totter down now. And the other one was Floyd Malloy in his flipping split seconds outfit. So there's those two. Then we had some cereal toys that we got in cereals, like these two wrestlers in me pockets. So we've got this Jester one here, who, I don't think he's going to stand up, is he? Um, nope. And this lion guy too. So we've got those two. And I'd rather have a bowl of Cocoa Pops, the monkey from the Cocoa Pops advert. So there was all of those. And then the last thing that was in the auction was this Big Mac transforming, uh, transforming vintage Big Mac. So there he is. So, like I say, that was on for 99 pence. I had 98 pence on, got, got one in the auction, a couple of quid postage, came for about £3.50 in total. I think I've kind of got my money's worth there. Pretty happy with that. Let us know what you think. Was that a good deal? Was that a bad deal? Andy, which one's your favourite? Which one do you like the best? Which one's your favourite? Obviously the Burger King's the best for me. Probably the Nelson as well, just because I've got some pretty cool memories of that. And Lester Sludge, quite possibly my favourite mask figure also. So there you go. Thanks for watching, guys. Do stay tuned for more hauls, more tricks, more things that I pick up, and, and, talking poos maybe coming back. See ya.